Hey guys, so today I'm going to show you how to install the Nauticus Smart Tabs SX. This is the 80 pound version. They're pretty simple to install and they work like a charm. Let's get to it. Alright guys, so the first thing you want to do is you want to take a tape measure, mark over how far you want your tabs to sit, which I want mine 4 inches. It says 3 to 5 inches, so I had to split the difference, put my 4. Take and put your plate up. Take your Sharpie marker and mark all your holes. That way you can go back and drill. Now what you want to do is you want to take a drill to so the 730 seconds. And go ahead and drill out your holes, which I've already done so. Now take some silicone. Put some silicone in each one of your holes that you drilled out. I like to apply a little bit of extra around the circle of your hole as well. Doesn't have to look perfect, it's going to smear out flat. I like to take, put a little bit of extra around. The more silicone, the better. Any excess is going to squeeze out. Now what you want to do. Now what you want to do, they have it all siliconed up. Take your Phillips head screwdriver. Start your middle hole. And go ahead and start putting all the screws in. Don't tighten them down all the way just yet. Put them in snug. Now you have them all in snug, go back and tighten them down all the way. Go back and wipe your excess silicone off. Kind of caulks the edge. I like to take and fill up all cracks. Alright, so that's the mount plate. Alright, so next step is take your tab itself, put the bolts in, hold it in place. You don't have to worry about your nuts right now, we're just mocking it up. Take your hydraulic cylinder. Lock it up. Now what you want to do is go ahead and take it where you want your cylinder bracket to be. Take a Sharpie marker. Mark your holes out. Take you a drill where the holes are. Start slow. Alright, now you have your holes drilled. Now wipe off the dust. Gonna fill these holes up with silicone. Slide around it too. Again, can't ever have too much silicone. Now go ahead, take a drill, start the screw. 
Your other screw is going to start it too. Wipe off your extra silicone. Get it extra around the edge. Get a good tight seal. All right, now you got that done. Gonna go back and put your nuts on everything. And it says only hand tighten them down. They fit pretty snug, so you don't want to tighten them down too much. You have to take a ratchet and tighten them down. I actually make it to where it won't move freely. So that's probably why I say this hand tighten it. Okay, now you got all those nuts in. Got them all finger tight. I'm going to take your pin. You gotta stick it right here, top of your clip. Take a little bit of pressure to get it through. There you got that in. It's good to go. Simple as that. It's one of the easiest tab installations I think in the market. You don't have to install any pumps, any electronics. It's all gas pressure driven. And as you ride your boat some more, figure it out. You have different adjustments here. Obviously, pin all the way in is your tightest, which is going to be your full 80 pounds. And each knot out, there you go. It's going to reduce the pressure. I'm not sure about how much, but it actually it does. So, there you go. I'm actually doing an open water test here soon. I'll show you how it works. And until next time. Tight lines.